Hello there. This is Wayne. In last video, we introduced a fatty nut butter grinder MBM 200. It's significant to include MBM 200 uh, in the bin to bar equipment because such high efficient nut butter grinder can greatly assist to accelerate completion of the chocolate counting process. So in this video, we want to introduce Bailey chocolate counting machine 510 uh, medium production type and the 502 table type. Okay, so the most uh, important mission for the counting process is to remove the acidity and to remove a wanted substance through the process. And during the process, we refine the particle size of the mass uh, to 20 micron. It's something like 600 to 700 meshes. For reference, the fine creamy Japanese uh, matcha powder is around the 400 meshes. So you will get better understanding how smooth is the 20 micron perform. And the conjunct process enable the sugar and the mess uh, to blend perfectly, enhancing the sweetness and the richness of the chocolate. And the continuous kneading, shearing, cutting will generate the heat. The normally the heat is between the 48 to 50 degree Celsius. So the heat will contribute evaporation of the acidity. And also such a uh, constant temperature around the 50 degree is one of the most important elements to make good test of the chocolate. Okay, so normally it requires continuous 48 hours to 72 hours to completion uh, of the consumption process. So uh, the quality performance of the, of the machine must be very durable and reliable. To operate a 510 start button, stop button, and this is for emergency stop. Push the button to stop. Twist the button to be back to position. The key component include dust proof cover. This cover can be adjusted of the height. But we recommend to keep the cover open as much as possible. So it will, will help to evaporate the acidity. And this is a set of natural granny stones. The stone is with special grooves. So the grooves will help uh, to increase contact point between uh, the stone and uh, the mass. This is a shovel blade to circulate the materials. And the, the capacity of the container is about uh, 8 kilograms. This is a pressure adjusting device. This device is to be used as needed. So when you turn clockwise direction, we increase the pressure to the stone. But it recommended to keep slight contact uh, between the stone and the base. Okay, so to remove the materials out of the container, first remove the cover. Unlock the, the locker. Here, 
the container to the position and insert the fixing bolt into the hole to keep the tilting position. To disassemble the container for cleaning up, first remove the nub. Remove the upper frame. And the stone. And lift the container for cleaning up. Okay, so now we put everything back. Put the container on the rotation drive set. Fix the stone on the base. And the upper frame. Slip the board into the uh, the over shape hole. When you put everything back, make a quick test. Rotate the container and the container will drive the stone rolling. And it should be quiet. If any noise happen, it can be caused by a loose part. So check with the all connection part to be fixing well. And the test again until it's normal. Next, have a look at 502 table type. The capacity of the container is 4 kilograms. So it's very convenient to carry uh, for small quantity production. And this is in-house developed motor. This motor is very reliable and durable. It can produce quite powerful twisting force to drive the machine. And this is a good snake uh, ceramic heater so it can be flexible uh, to make any desired position so you can deliver heat inside the container or outside the container so to disassemble the container for cleaning up first Remove the cover. Remove uh, the nut. And remove the plate. And the positional support. Beware of the spring. Hold it together with the support. And the stone. and lift the container for cleaning up. Okay, so now we put everything back. Put the container on the rotation drive set. And the stone, fix on the base. And slip the bolt into the over shape hole. Okay, so after you put everything back, make a quick test. Rotate the container. The container will uh, drive the 
uh, the stone rolling. So it should be quiet. If any noise occurs, can be caused by the loose part. So check with the, the old part to be fixing well. And make a test again until it's normal.